Good morning, everybody. It's Mel from Melamori Nursery. I hope everybody's doing well. I am doing well, really well myself. It is, uh, yeah, it's literally uh, 20 to 4 in the morning. 20 to 4 in the morning. Uh, my watch is off, but I wanted to show you. And the reason I sound so happy is because I am back into the swing of my um, old schedule which I missed really so very much. Um, and as I spoke about yesterday, I, I, uh, I longed to get back into it. Um, so um, I know it sounds strange, but I really love my job. I really love um, doing what I do, which is writing for mental health. And, and I got some of the topics that I, I began to uh, look into and uh, quite exciting stuff, really exciting stuff for me. And, um, you know, mental health is really such a, there's one of my hairs again. Hello. Mental health for me is such a fascinating uh, topic because like physical health, it is uh, quite holistic. It's, it's, um, it's a unification of our, our entire um, brain, essentially, how we think, how we feel, how we um, perceive things, um, how we interpret the world, everything. And uh, I love learning about uh, not only the biological aspects of uh, mental health, but also um, the more specific areas about mental health as well about how it affects each and every person individually and so um yeah i've missed it i've really missed it and i really hope um that those of you that are working really enjoy your jobs as much as i do because to me it, it really isn't work at all it's uh it's i kind of emerge myself into a place that you know is um it is a fascinating uh, play yard of, of information, never ending information. So that's why I, I sound really upbeat and happy at 20 to four in the morning when most people are sleeping. Um, so here I have before you, Miss Vivia. <clears throat> now Vivia jumped the line a little bit. I must admit she jumped the line. Um, because I was speaking about her yesterday too. And holy, I hope I don't lose my voice, folks. It's been a while since I, I lost my voice. But again, uh, I'm not used to sitting, uh, researching in a chair all night long. So um, my body is getting used to that. I'm trying to take pr plenty of breaks. And so if I lose my voice, please know that um, this too shall pass. Um, Vivia was my very, very first doll I ever got from Tracy over at Tracy's Little Treasures. Um, she is the Vivia Sculpt by Melody Hess. I have only one other doll by Melody Hess, which is my uh, Cray, who is the Jupiter Sculpt. And uh, this little darling here is uh, about 19 and a half inches long. And she's got to be about six pounds, two ounces, somewhere in there. And she has been in this outfit for a while. And the reason she jumped the line is because um, she was in yellow. <laughs> and oh, she's slipping down there. She was in yellow. And uh, I was thinking, okay, I could get around this by, you know, taking down some of the babies into their basic onesies and beginning there but I just absolutely wanted to show you all this this beautiful jacket again um this came home with her with her box opening um this little thumper uh outfit came with her as well uh she's got on these shoes which I'd picked up for her which are the white bell shoes and um let's see you and she is just, oh my goodness, she is just a little beauty. Now, my oldest daughter is, um, my oldest daughter is going to be having a baby in a few months. And I expect their baby will look very similar to Vivia. 
very, very similar to Vivia. Um, although I'm not saying whether she's having a boy or a girl, it really doesn't matter at this point. My daughter doesn't want to really make it known on the internet at this moment. So, um, but little Vivia here, um, has a, a little bit of a, uh, Asian look to her. And I love that about her. I love that about her. Even when I spotted her for the first time, um, on Tracy's site. And as always, I will leave Tracy's information in the, um, description box below. So, um, it's winter, so, um, I can't do Cena's tag, which is onesie Wednesday. Um, but I will be embracing that a lot more this summer because I'm starting to really love that look as I explained yesterday as well. Um, so today is Shara's, Miss Shara's tag again, and that is on Wednesdays, we wear pink. And I wanted to thank each and every one of you for uh, viewing my videos lately and um, or at any time and uh, taking the time out of your day to leave a comment and a like. I highly appreciate it and uh, I know it's sometimes really hard to do uh, if you watch it on the TV or um, aren't those cute with the old-fashioned bell? I found them actually. Uh, it says left and right, small left and right. So they were new. Again, they were shoes thrifted. Um, so, and these are about show. And let's just see if you guys can get a good glimpse because I'm pretty sure I am pronouncing that right. Hopefully you can read into there without too much darkness. So, yeah. Um, and she's just got frilly little socks on here. And remorsefully, I'm going to take off this jacket. Yes, I am, darling. Oh, I don't want to, though. I love this little coat. I love it. And um, yellow is Vivia's color. It really is. And... Tracy themed her out in this color. And I might as well take out that hair bow too. And just get her hair kind of brushed while I'm doing it. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I love this doll. So this jacket was from Nutmeg and yeah, it's gorgeous. I, I just, I love everything about it. I love that it's quilted. It's so super soft. And it's got blue and brown and turquoise and white flowers on it with the hat. And then it calls, it has these like duffel bag closure at the front, which I don't know why I'm doing up because I'm going to be hanging up the jacket, but I just wanted to show you. It's just gorgeous. Love it. So, um, and then she's got with her today, she's got a little giraffe. So, yeah, oh my goodness, look at her. Look at her. So, not only did I have, um, I was back to some medical appointments yesterday, and um, those went really, really well. So I'm doing, I'm doing so much better, folks. Uh, so much better. Um, and, you know, I'm starting to uh, incorporate some mobility into my day, um, which is the goal, has always been the goal of... Um, of everything that I've gone through over the last few months. And I want to thank you all, uh, all, and you, like, especially, um, especially, you know, some of the very close friends that I have to that watch and have reached out to me and throughout this process, you can't know how much it means to me, but I really want to thank you guys all for being my cheerleading squad in the background because, uh, it really helps. And, um, you know, I, 
I think, you know, when we lift each other up, you know, when we, we can do that, I think it makes a huge difference, you know, and it's very, um, it's very heartwarming for me to see how many people love and care and are so committed to uh, uh, like somebody they don't even know, you know what I'm saying? And then, you know, there's been some incredible friendships made on here as well. So, you know, I, I just, I'm so grateful. So this is a little thumper. Um, it's actually a dress, but I put it on her as a shirt and it's by the Disney zero to three months. So it's actually a little dress, but we compromise around here and do our own thing. And she's got little yellow pants on and these socks. Um, her coloring actually is um, quite unique as well. She, you know, this is why I said, like, I can see her coloring is just so, you know, like, pale, you know, almost like mine, but a little bit more like warmy. She's got more warm in her coloring. I've got more like red tones in mine and Vivia has definitely more yellow tones in hers. So I hope these socks will function okay. I'll get her down to her white onesie and give you a good look at her in her white little onesie. And then I will show you what we're going to put on her today. And uh, so, yeah. So between yesterday and today, these were next baby up to one month. And they were the bottoms of another shirt that I chose not to put on at the same time. Okay, so, yeah, look at her. Oh, my goodness. Like this baby. Oh, my goodness. And the fact that she can put her finger in her thumb or finger in her mouth, and her hands clenched up. Oh, I just love it. Just love this baby. Yes, I do. Yeah. She is just magical. Look how she moves. Just so sweet. So, I don't want to make this a half an hour video. So, I'm going to try to... Um, I try to stop yapping so much, even though I'm taking a bit of a longer break, but to give my body a bit of a break from the chair. Uh, computer chairs are something that I had to kind of work up to um, because they all swivel, you see? And um, so, yeah. So what I'm gonna put on her today is this um, snuggle, by one piece sleeper set with the footed um, bottoms. Now these are really interesting, see? So on a baby, you can like put those over their feet as like sleeper bottoms. And I hadn't seen these in a long, long time when I came across them. And so I've had these for quite a while and hadn't put them on her. So, or any of the babies. I don't know what I was waiting for, but there they are there. So I was going to put that on her. And since there is, like for Theme Thursday this week, uh, there's bears. I have this white um, mech baby, uh, zero to three month, three little bears. It's actually a cream with um, the bears on the inside it like that. And it's a sweater with this kind of, um, I don't know if you can see that, that sort of texture on it. And then it comes with a bear hat. And Vivi is, you know, I haven't really put hats on Vivi all that much. And it comes with little uh, bear booties. So that's what we're going to be putting on her. And I'm going to keep the same socks, even though they're white, but... Um, only because I didn't bring down anything else and I might even put on gloves 
for a little contrast, which are white with black dots and just this color there. But we'll see. We will see. So yeah, I'm really enjoying the fact that my life is sort of back to the routine that I was used to. And um, I really enjoy having a routine in my life, it, uh, especially because I've been working from home for so many years. And um, I like being active. I like being mobile. I like, um, I like, um, I like doing what I do, to be honest. And uh, I like the fact that, you know, in some small way, I'm contributing to, you know, uh, training aids when it comes to mental health, um, because I think that's like extremely important. Um, I don't think there's anybody that's not affected in some way, shape or form by mental health. Um, it's just, if not more important than physical health, because it's something you can you can't see right off the bat. You can't see it. Uh, unlike a cast on an arm or a leg, you can see that, right? But you can't see. Oh, look at that. That was a bounce sheet, folks, in case you were wondering. That was, that was a bounce sheet in the arm. Um, so, uh, when I store, when I store the, the clothes of the dolls, just off topic a little bit here. Uh, when I store the, the doll's clothes, I sometimes fold them up into tubs and say, you know, for example, uh, this size here, which I've probably labeled as zero to three, um, or sleepers. I think this one was in a zero to three sleeper tub. And I just simply uh, will put bounce sheets in it to keep everything fresh because I love the smell of bounce. Bounce reminds me absolutely of my nanny. So and I love, I love it smelling so fresh. Yeah, it must be zero to three because it's quite a larger sleeper on her. But look how comfortable she looks in it. And I love babies to have movement here, but <clears throat> so yeah, I think, I think mental health is extremely important. And, you know, so, uh, and then, and then, you know, as well, I'm healing too, which for me is, uh, you know, I feel finally that, you know, I'm out, I'm getting some fresh air. Our weather's been halfway, you know, decent. I mean, we had, we had some sunshine yesterday. Um, I had a couple of appointments and, you know, yeah, the appointments, uh, physically speaking, you know, they're, they're not, you know, all sunshine and you know a walk in the park if you know what I mean they're not they're not uh they're not fun some of these appointments are really um um trying in the sense that you know um you know I'm working my body in ways that it hadn't been worked you know it it, it was all stiff and sore and had to be worked and that, that's tough but at the same token you know I'm healing folks like I'm healing I feel like you know um you know and anybody who's been through this sort of thing understands and um <clears throat> and I'm just so grateful now that I'm I'm kind of past that that lump you know um and it, it, it's not, you know, I'm not completely like free and clear of everything going on with my, my physical health, but, you know, at least if I can make some improvements in some areas, you know, I'll take it, I'll take it and I'll go with it. And, uh, so yeah. And then to, to, to get my work stuff and to be able to go over all of that, um, I just feel like, I don't know, like brand new year, brand new day. It's all exciting. So I really hope each and every one of you feel like excited about something too. And, and, um, you know, I, uh, as long as for me, as long as like, we don't get another dumping of snow <laughs> and I hate to say this, but you know, as long as I don't get another dumping of snow, cause that'll prevent me from like even getting in a small little walk, which, you know, I really, um, I really want to continue, you know, getting in some walks. And my daughter has been like really excellent um, in in helping me. And, you know, I'm so, 
I'm so lucky to have her, honestly. So, yeah. So that's what I've been doing. I've been just focusing on that. And I had two appointments yesterday. And, you know, it's all good. All good. So, yeah. She looks cute with this. Oh, my goodness. I like it. I would have never thought. I had these, um, this sweater and this, um, matched up with a different outfit for a boy. And I looked at it and I thought, you know what? Um, because theme Thursday is bears and it's either pink or blue as the alternative for, for girl or boy. I thought, well, I can kind of lead into that with Vivia because I really wanted to bring her on today. Um, I really did. The start of it all with Tracy's dolls. So, um, and like I said, you know, unless I, I wanted to bring down my other dolls down to their onesies, most of my other dolls are in pink. So, you know, and I'm going to have to, you know, remedy that. So, and that, I think that comes from doing like the same hashtags every week, right? So, um, that's essentially how it is. Now, I don't know if I want to do that up or not. I don't know if I do. But let's try this little hat on her. Come here, darling. I have no idea how this hat is going to look like on her. <laughs> oh, it's cute. It's cute with the little bear ears. You can barely see the, the outline. I've got the lamp kind of sitting differently. But... It's cute. And then she's got these little booties. I don't think it matters which side is which, so. But yeah. So cream and pink for today's color. And I cut her a new pacifier because her original pacifier was a lobster and of course it wouldn't match. So that was like cut like that to fit in her mouth. So I just finished cutting her a new one, and this one is of a fox. And so it slides into her mouth. And that is Vivia with a soother. And oh, I was gonna try on these gloves. Let's see, sweet pea. Let's see how you look like with these gloves. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not feeling those gloves, baby girl. Not feeling those gloves. I think maybe if they were cream, perhaps, but, you know, they're a good prompt. But, yeah, I think for another something. But she does have a little unicorn that I'm just going to put up here behind her. Because she's already fast asleep. And... Those are some crochets that my daughter did. So I wanted to just kind of tie that into her, her outfit. And that's it, everybody. I pray you all have a blessed and beautiful day. Happy Wednesday to each and every one of you. Thank you again, Shara, for this hashtag. On Wednesdays, we wear pink. And I will show you her gorgeous little mouth again because I love it so much. And Tracy, if you're watching, remember, I will always be grateful for all of your babies. And little Miss Vivia started it all, didn't she, sweetheart? She certainly did. All right, folks. I will see you next time. Bye for now.